What's up, I'm Adam. I'm here at my self build. I'm quickly going to show all the DIYers out there how to basically bed and point your verge tiles. I don't have a trade, I just have a go. If you're a roofer watching this video, you're probably in the wrong place. Old school mortar. Um, first of all, you want to spray a little bit. You're on the rickety scaffold. A little bit of spray gives it a chance for the mortar to go well. I use a gauging trowel. I'm gonna get your first bit. If you wanna know the mortar mix, I've linked the video up here and also about how to cut first tiles video as well. So you're gonna go big sausage if you can. This is awkward because I'm doing it backwards. It would be easier if I was left-handed. Just to mention, you should try and keep your mortar off the end of your battens, otherwise they rot out eventually. And then smaller sausage down here. If you keep it, you see that line there? If you keep it back, about 10 mil or so, it just looks nicer when you do it. Get your old tile, spray that one, and we're in. Squish your tile down and take this bit, push it in there. And then we're going to whack a screw in because it's easier to put a screw in rather than hitting a nail in and disturbing your mortar. Uh, these are stainless steel, they're probably not the best ones, they're a little bit brittle, but it's what I had, so that's what I'm putting on. I'll quickly show you. So, what I'm going for is about a five mil gap there. Obviously, the mortar's just stepped off a little bit, and then here is about 40 to 50 mil the best that's about 50 so that's what I'm doing and then try and keep it as clean as you can obviously people come back and point this afterwards but I like to do it as best as I can in the first place and then I've got less to point and then you can come back when it's a little bit dry these bits here if you do get the muck over basically what you do get a microfiber cloth see where I've drops a little bit of mortar down here you basically rub it off so once it's dried a little bit you get microfiber and you just wipe it off and just to prove that I can do it is what I've done earlier it's definitely handy when you've got proper scaffold instead of this kind of stuff and if you're hanging off a ladder, you're probably gonna mess it up a little bit, but that should be all right. Give it a little while. I'll smooth that off, polish it up, make it look all nice. Anyway, that's how you do it. If you're interested in the self-build vlog, please do subscribe, hit the bell notification. Thanks for watching. I'll see you later.